So this is an example of how, just how to kind of imagine how the derivative is being traced out. So here we have the tangent line on the red graph. Okay, so there's my straight tangent line. And the orange point is plotting out the derivative values or the slope values. So here we have negative slope values at that point. Okay, oh, sorry. So we have negative slope values through here. Okay, and as it gets more and more horizontal, it'll hit the zero point. Okay, go through the zero as it goes from negative slope to positive slope. And as we move along that curve, notice that as the slope tangent line moves along the curve, the slope values are being traced out in orange there, and it's tracing out that parabolic shape. So we can change this to, you know, we can look at a quadratic, so x squared function. Okay, and as I again, as I move that quadra the tangent line along the graph, notice how the slope values are changing. In this case, the quadratic sl uh, slope values are changing linearly, and they're just being traced out on that straight line there as I plot that. Okay, and I can plot all sorts of different graphs on here. You know, I can plot a, a power 4 graph. Okay, so x power 4 plus, you know, I'm just going to randomly do x to power 3 or something like that. Okay, so if you notice I have a few little bumps and stuff through there, and I move that graph, if I move my red point, my tangent point, notice that the slopes go from very steep negative, okay, it goes to zero, okay, it's going up there. This is a little bit harder to see, and maybe I'll try some a little bit different values here to make it accentuate a little bit more, but again, as I trace that, that red point, very steep point, it has very steep values, there it is, there's my slope values coming down going to come to a horizontal tangent. Okay, it's going to become steep again. Okay, and at its steepest point, notice that there the the slope values are at its max as well. See? See how it's right at the maximum slope value there as it goes to the steepest point. Zero slope, okay, it goes to the zero and again, very steep negative it just dives off my page.